feel great responsibility to do right. This feeling quickly turns to fear, and doing right becomes impossible when acting in fear. I'm the oldest of four siblings. I have two sisters, a brother. I miss all of them and feel guilty that I don't talk to them more. I feel the worst about my younger sister. Since my stepdad and mom divorced, he's taken his anger and pain out on her. This verbal abuse leads her to feelings of helplessness and desperation, and she often reaches out to me for help. I rarely pick up the phone when she calls. I have no response, no advice. I don't want to seem foolish. As the oldest, my actions have created an example for all three of them of how to behave and what to expect from others. My absence reeks and leaves an expectation of isolation and abandonment. I lived in a woman's shelter for two months after my parents divorced. I couldn't play with the other kids because the moms were afraid I would assault their daughters. I was seven. I think that love is the full state of existence and brings us closest to recognition of the largeness of living. It reminds us of the limits we have and the incredible amount of space for joy and fullness before that limit. It is an infinity in a small space. I feel most alive when talking deeply and honestly with one person. I feel least alive in the time between when I go to bed and when I fall asleep. I've had two nervous breakdowns and was hospitalized both times. I'm in constant fear of once again losing control of my mind. Every misplaced item becomes evidence of my mental disarray, every forgotten plan in the day a footprint of my mind's decline. I'm afraid that the fear I act within will create a constriction around those I love and that they will escape, leaving me in a loneliness marked by quiet resignation and an acceptance of my failures in action and in thought.